we were wrong about the zombie apocalypse as a title that is definitely on point with what the story is about. And when you think of a zombie apocalypse, you usually think, you know, like zombies rising from the grave and uh, eating people, killing people and eating them, eating their victims, only to have them become zombies, all that terrifying stuff. This one takes that kind of idea and does something totally new and totally fresh. And it's really, really well written, and I, I commend the writer for this. The story describes a zombie apocalypse. Now these zombies, they don't eat their victims, and they also seem to be killing only certain selected targets. Basically, it's like a revenge trip. Like if you murdered somebody and they came back from the grave, they would come for you because you killed them. So they're kind of like Ghost Rider, Spirit of Vengeance kind of thing. Now the government does try to interfere at some point, but it doesn't work, and more of these zombies seem to appear, which is a pretty disturbing sign. The story also gets into how parents react to their children, you know, coming back to life and returning to them. And it's actually quite disheartening in some case, but it's also, in a strange way, it's touching. It's nice, you know, you get this certain feeling that a parent is reunited with their lost child, and it's it's a good feeling. But it's also quite disturbing because, well, they're a zombie. All in all, this is a very, very well-written creepypasta. I cannot recommend this one enough. The writer took something cliche and made it into something that's fresh and new. Definitely check this one out, guys. You will not regret it.